hey guys thanks for clicking this offer via my link so in this video i'm going to show you that how to avoid uh, to landing your emails on the spam or promotion folders of your recipients right so right now i am just creating that email to my email list to send about that product launch called about that webinar loop so uh, here i just created my uh, email on my autoresponder so this is the subject i am providing you and this is the content i created for my email list so before i send this content to my email list so if i click this i can able to see that what is the content here so here i just putting that hey name calm down actually you not yet earn that money but you have potential to earn that much money per sale when you use this tool yes webinar the new webinar platform is launched today check out my review and cool bonuses here see you in my next email so this is that very simple text i just created on this email and i'm ready to send this email to my list but before i am simply sending this i just want to test whether this email will be landed to my recipient email on their inbox or their spam folder or their promotion folders right so for that i am using some of the free tools that is called gmas.co slash inbox right so i just spell it on the notepad here it's gmas g m a s s dot co slash inbox right so this this is the website usually i am testing for um, before sending my email whether that email will be landed on my recipient's spam folder or inbox. So let's say for example, so this is that website here, you can send your emails to these email IDs. It's around 19 emails is there. So you see some of the emails. This particular email is having 20 years old Gmail account and 10 year old Gmail account and some of the emails is G Suite emails with filtered by Sophos, Barracuda, and uh, Semantic, Mimecost. That there are uh, various. Sorry, there are various uh, um, email filter software is inbuilt with this G Suite and Gmail website itself. So now what I'm going to do, I just simply copy this first email ID, the 20 year old Gmail account copy it and come back to my autoresponder and send the test email from this before sending this and just send the test email for these email ids i just paste this email and select that 10 year old gmail account also here right for these two emails i'm just sending my uh, email to test it right so i just add these things and just send test mail and those emails are sent from my autoresponder to these emails now i come back to this gmas.co slash inbox and ref refresh this page then i can able to see where my emails is landed you see here on 20 year old gmail my email is landed on promotions folder but on 10 years old Gmail account, my emails are landed on primary inbox folder, right? So, so if I send that email, if my recipient is having more than 20 years old uh, account, then my email may be landed on their promotions uh, tab. So they are, uh, my emails is getting less chance to view by my recipient. So what I need to do, I just want to make sure both this, this 10 years old Gmail account and uh, 20 years old Gmail accounts or two, both the two email accounts should catch my, catch my email from their primary inbox. So for that, what I need to do, I need to change my content a little bit uh, for that, right? So generally, um, here, if I go and edit my content on my content editor inside the autoresponder, 
you can see this this is the little content I'm using so here I cannot see the, um, the content no thing is there maybe this bonuses this bonus this word may leads to the promotion step so I just want to use this bonus I don't want to change this uh, any other word so then so that what I can do I can use some trick here instead of putting wo I can put zero here then user can read this as a bonus but that computer or that um, auto filter tool may not read this as a bonus right it's, they will read this as b0n right likewise they will read it so same way i just change this uh, title also in this so for that i just select it and go to here and change this one as zero then save this let's see what happened i just click the save and next Okay, then again I just try to send the test mail right so I just copy this email first the 20 years old gmail account right then this 10 year old gmail account and just such this send the test mail so now my object objective my email should be landed on the primary inbox for this both the email then my end goal is, is reached right so i just refresh my page and check it yes that's it so we done it right so you see that 20 year old gmail account my email it's landed on primary inbox and my 10 year old gmail account my email is landed on primary inbox so my end goal it achieved so this is the way how you can avoid your email on spam or promotion folders right so use this technique next time you are sending that email to your clients right so thanks for picking up this offer via my link so once again thanks so i will see you in next time in some other places on the internet bye bye